Africa that would be great as well, and, and the kind of parallels between the two. Um, yeah. Okay, Gaga. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much for your, your question. I understand exactly where you're coming from. Um, in fact, I, I happen to believe that this question um, is, is the subject for another complete uh, evening, really. Uh, how, how would the Palestinians be able to return to their homeland? Well, there is only one way, uh, and that is if Zionism ended in, in that part of the world. Because while you have a Zionist state insisting that it has to be Jewish, i.e. it has to have a Jewish majority, and it has the strength to, to do that, you can see that there isn't a way for the Palestinians to return. However, if you want to talk about how that would be, uh, you would have to really talk about uh, this <coughs> concept of a one-state solution. That is that you don't have any partition of the land into a Palestinian state and a Jewish state. Secondly, uh, Zionism comes to an end. It would come to an end indeed if the Palestinians were to return home because that would be the end of the Jewish majority. And therefore, that is really the only way. And if people want to help the Palestinians, I personally think they need to support this solution. It's the only one that would allow the right of return. And once that were to happen, you know, uh, you would actually, at one stroke, put an end to this um, uh, racist idea that the state has to have a majority of one type of person and not another. And that, I'm afraid, is the only way. Thank you very much. Um, I don't know if the rest of the panel want to come back on that just very quickly. Jenny. Well, I think the problem with that, Garda, is I think you used the phrase getting near the Zionists or the Zionists must go and that is the difficulty because they do sit, feel so passionately about their position but as I said in my opening remarks um, beware Israel um, Israel is not going to be there forever in its present performance because one day the United States of America will get sick of giving 70 billion a year to Israel to support its, what I call, America's aircraft carrier in the Middle East, that is Israel. One day, the US people are going to say to the Israel lobby in the USA, enough is enough. Read that book by Walton Mearsheimer called The Israel Lobby. It's rubbish. Find out about it. Of course it's rubbish. It's absolutely rubbish. Out, wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? I'm reading a critique of it. It's rubbish. But it's rubbish. it will not go critique. on forever. It will not go on forever. Israel will lose its support. And then they will reap what they have sowed. Can you say? Yeah. Just like by now, I think it's getting a little bit.